Matt Johnson back here, putting the finishing touches on a one nothing loss for the Bulldogs against the Augustana Vikings. Matt Johnson again being joined by UMD head coach Greg Kane. And coach, uh, this is a tough one. I mean, your team played well. You got uh, 17 shots off, 10 of them on target. Um, you actually outshot them overall for the game. But uh, it was a difference between making one play here, one play there. And uh, unfortunately for you guys, it was Augustana that made that one play here tonight. Right. Uh, that's just uh, the way it's been going for us. Um, when we do make a play, it's uh, a great save on the other side, or you know, it's a deflection, or it's just not going for us right now. Um, that and that's the way that it that it goes sometimes. Well, and, you know, you guys in that first ten minutes of the game are really all over them. I mean, oh. you create so many opportunities, and, oh. and we were kind of thinking that me and uh, my color man Jerry Ostrom, we were thinking that you guys were going to break through right yeah. away, and. Yeah. It just didn't happen for you. Yeah, I was so impressed with our team right off the start. The, the energy, the spirit was high. and um, You know, we were just on it and getting the balls first and, um, you know, getting balls to players in dangerous areas and players, you know, making 1v1 plays. Um, you know, we were extremely dangerous. Uh, goalkeeper was pressed, you know, to make a couple saves, one off the bar, another one went off the side bar. You know, and you just, you know, you think, okay, something's going to happen. Right. And, um just doesn't happen. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's just the way it is right now for us. It's tough. And that's, uh, sometimes it just, just comes down to that. I mean, you, there's nothing else you can really tell your team other than to just keep yeah. plugging away and hopefully that goal will come. Yeah. That's what I told the team at the end of the game. I said, look, I don't have an answer for you. Um, but I do know a couple of things. One, um, you know, you played extremely well uh, tonight for large portions of the game. Um, we deserve more uh, for certain. And um, – we just got to keep our chin up and worry about the next game. Well, I know the thing with you guys also, we talked about this, the front lo front portion of your schedule is pretty tough, especially in conference play. I mean, yeah. you guys have played four very, very good yeah. teams in a row, and now things maybe get a little bit easier. You know, I mean, every game in this conference is tough, but now you have a Wayne yeah. State team coming in here on, yeah. on Sunday, and hopefully you can turn around against them. It may be the one redeeming thing out of that, um, but the way that results are going in our conference right now, um, it, really doesn't, it really doesn't matter. And, uh, you know, these games are extremely close. Uh, they do hinge on on a play here, a play there, and then and then those are the points. Yep. And yep. that's that's what you uh, live with, and that's what you die with. So it's uh, right now it's fr frustrating. So that's the story here. Unfortunately for Milosky staying, the Bulldogs falling to Augustana. Final score here, one nothing. Up next for UMD, they will be hosting Wayne State right here at Milosky Stadium. 12 noon, the opening kickoff for that contest. Myself and Jerry Ostrom will be on with the pregame starting at 1245. So thank you, Coach Kane, and hopefully better look on Sunday. Thank you. <laughs> so that's it. Thank you for watching, everybody.